What is going on, Brotherhood? Welcome to a brand new video, and today is a special day because today is the undisputed birthday. No, it is not my birthday. It is the one year birthday of the channel. So I figured we'd celebrate a bit and we were going to replay my very first video just to show you guys how far we've come in terms of content and, you know, quality and editing and all that sort of stuff. Because my first video, it's pretty bad compared to my current ones. I'll warn you guys that now, but we'll all be laughing, we'll all be cringing, so it'll be a great time. And, uh, yeah, I guess I will play the video right now. Oh, boy. What's up guys, TJ back here from the Undisputed Brotherhood and today we have an action figure review of the Elite Series 43 Samoa Joe. As you can see, Joe comes with a fabric shirt which is pretty rare nowadays and I'm glad they're bringing them back perhaps. And his towel which is unfortunately rubber. If we remove the towel one thing about the shirt is it has a massive neckline, although the towel does a perfect job of covering it up. The shirt says Samoa Joe SO Cal with the SJ logo in the middle and it says Submission Specialist. The shirt comes off at the back and one thing that's different is uh, the placement with the Velcro. Is It's weird, the right side goes on top, usually it's the left side I find. I don't know, maybe it's just me. Joe's got his left hand taped up, and the cool part about this figure is the whole figure is new molds for the lower body, the knees, the stomach, everything. And as you can see here, Joe's face scan is quite accurate. I've heard some people have had some paint flaws, but mine turned out quite well. And we'll give him the NXT title that came with my elite Kevin Owens. Comment down below if you want to see that reviewed. And overall, this figure, probably a solid 8 or 9 out of 10. It's, uh, it's, not, it's not perfect, but it's pretty good. I mean, the towel could have been fabric so that he could do his pose where he holds up the towel in the ring. But it's still quite a good elite figure. I do recommend picking it up if you find it. It's pretty hard to find at retail. I got mine from Ringside Collectibles. Anyways, if you like this video, follow me on Twitter at TJRWWE07. Like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe for more. Well, I have certainly seen worse from first videos, but we've come a long way from there. Clearly in that video, I did not know how to turn off autofocus, I didn't unplug my fridge, which was that god-awful noise in the background, and I don't know if it's just me, but my voice sounded pretty squeaky in that video, it's maybe I'm the other one noticing it, but yeah, that's my first ever video I uploaded on my channel, and uh, I just can't thank you guys enough, because we have come so far in one year, already 5,000 subscribers, and like, it's insane. Our channel has grown so much, and we've done so many amazing things. I mean, WrestleMania, Survivor Series, and then Raw and SmackDown just last week. It's been insane. I cannot begin to thank you guys enough. Make sure you guys do check out all my links in the description below if you do want to interact with me at all on social media and stuff like that. But yeah, I cannot thank you guys enough. Happy birthday, Undisputed Brotherhood, for uh, many more years to come, I'm sure. But until then, guys, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video.